Hi guys, my name is Yelena Brilliant. I'm the owner of Brilliant Massage and Skin Care. And um, recently I also started to do more uh, social media, especially here um, during the COVID. I don't know if I can see that um, on YouTube. Anyways, but um, so Instagram is really challenging. It's probably one of the hardest platforms to conquer, but so is YouTube. I'm really putting effort into Instagram right now first, kind of gain more followers, and I'm going to share with you what worked for me. It's been a couple of months, so it's, um, make sure that you update your bio, that it's neat precise describes what you do, what your account is about, who you are, any links to your website or business or store. Then have a um, sort of idea what you're going to post, create like a schedule because if you don't have a schedule and you're just going to post one month, you know, once a week, the other month you'll post every day, and <laughs> some other day you'll post five times a day. That's very confusing to whoever's following you. You want to kind of stick to schedule. I try to stick right now to like once a day, but if you don't have quality content, then it's better not to post anything because it's just going to ruin your feed when somebody, somebody goes to your profile. It's not going to look good. Now, I'm not saying that like I'm perfect and I'm Instagram pro, like I said, I'm just starting. I have 1,600 followers now and I know I like Instagrams, um, you know, with like some people having millions and hundreds of thousands, I have nothing. But you know, it's still more than having a couple hundred. And my goal is to get to 10,000. So, because I want to have the swipe up option, that's what you get once you get 10,000 followers. And also, you know, focus on hashtags, very important, because that will help people that are looking for your type of content on Instagram to connect with you. Like, when you search a certain hashtags or they search, your posts are going to show up. But, you know, just because you have, you have a hashtag, doesn't mean there will show up. Also, kind of Instagram algorithm has to like and has to think that your post is good to push it up more higher in that search, especially if it's a competitive hashtag. So make sure you create quality content and make sure that, you know, you get likes. Maybe even ask your friends, you know, to like your post, uh, your post once you post it because that will tell al algorithm that your photo is good when it right away gets likes, you know, I'm not good at it. I don't, I'm not good at asking people of liking my pictures, but that's an idea for you if you have a lot of friends, um, you know, like all these celebrities, if you look even Kardashians, they like each other posts, they always comment on each other posts. Now, I don't know if it's them or their assistants, whoever's writing their accounts, but they are doing it. Now, that that brings me to like another point, which is the assistant. You can also get someone to do engagement for you because engagement is very important. Like, if you're small and nobody knows you exist and Instagram's algorithm is, you know, not seeing many likes because you don't have exposure. Nobody's, you know, going to like if they're not seeing you. It's just kind of like what comes first, the chicken or the egg, you know. Like, so it's kind of hard to get out of these trenches. So that the way to do that, you want to go and like other people's posts, comment on other people's posts. And then in return, hopefully they will come visit your profile and see your pictures, follow them, and hopefully they will follow you. Um, don't do any shady tactics, bots, in my opinion. Well, they, first of all, they're against Instagram, uh, you know, ser terms of services. And also, they're just kind of scammy, and um, followers might be turned off and not want to go see or like your page anyways. You might get some followers from that. I'm not sure I never try those bots. But what I did try right now, um, just for a week, I had 
consistent for my Instagram the engagement just because I also have other full time job. So I kinda don't have time to go and like and sit all day on Instagram and try to comment. Um so that's actually got me like a hundred followers this week from doing the engagement. And I think I'm gonna continue doing that. So engagement is very important. You can find someone on Fiverr to do that for you. Um also, if you can get traffic from other sources, like if you have a blog, you do Facebook business, um, you know, other contacts where you could put up your handle, groups, whatnot, try to do that. That will help you as well. So this is just some tips that I've learned and I'm following. I'm trying to see how it works. And uh, you can follow me at Yolita Brilliant. I appreciate that. Send me a DM that you find me through this video and I will follow you, follow you back. Hope you enjoyed and hope this was helpful. Let me know in the comments down below if you have any questions. And subscribe to my YouTube. So I would appreciate that. Thumbs up.